I'm Dr. Victor Forge, and this is what I learned in school. I learned that Illinois has more autonomous units of government than any other state in the United States. Illinois has 8,000 independent units of government. This is a problem. Uh, the units of government are generally divided into counties. That means the state isn't divided into counties. There are 102 counties. There are also cities, villages, and towns which are autonomous and have self-rule and can opt out of certain laws that pertain to the entire state. Uh, furthermore, there are districts that have taxing powers, such as school districts, which are not contiguous with counties or townships. Uh, I forgot to mention that counties are usually divided into townships. So when people go to vote, it's really hard for them to determine who their representative is, because the boundaries of the districts do not follow the boundaries of the counties or of the townships or any other boundaries. The school boards can be, uh, don't, don't follow any districts, and sometimes there are even two school boards in the same area, because one is the elementary school board, and the other one is the high school school board. This is a problem because when we pay our taxes, a big portion of those taxes goes to the pension of government officials or people who have served in government. Now, of course, people who serve in government deserve to get pensions and everything that, that they deserve. But do we really need 8,000 separate autonomous units of government in Illinois? I don't think so. When Pat Quinn was a young lawyer and representative to the uh, House of Representatives of Illinois, each district had three representatives. So if a Democratic majority was in a district, there were two Democrats and one Republican that uh, went to the State House. Uh, Mr. Quinn put out a referendum and the people of Illinois decided that's quite a few representatives and they cut it down to one. Ever since then, he had a hard time because people were upset that he had cut down the number of uh, legislators in the legislature. But we need to do this in Illinois. We, we need to consolidate. We need to uh, make our boundaries contiguous with our townships, with our counties. We need to uh, keep the uh, units of government from overlapping, six different units doing the same things. We have so many elections in Illinois that people really don't know what they're voting for, when they're voting for it, because there just are so many autonomous units of government that the the, the, the ballot is uh, 165 different uh, positions on it. So it makes it harder and harder for, for people to understand who they're voting for, uh, to follow all the issues, to uh, categorize and prioritize which offices are more or less important. And this is not a good thing.